Hello, it's Erica from National AVC. Just wanted to reach out and give you some information on the virtual conference as we move forward. I'm sure many of you received emails or messages about our switchover. Uh, we are very excited that we're gonna have the opportunity to give you as much content as possible in a virtual format as opposed to the in-person. So as you can see here, it is now 2020 AFC Virtual Conference and Elevated Learning Experience. So I think all of us have been learning how to do things virtually and we're gonna do the same thing with the conference. First and foremost, we want to make sure that you know we're here for you and we're here to answer any questions. So we know that it's gonna be a little different, but we're here to support you. So a few updates and highlights. Uh, the kickoff is gonna be the same as if we had been in person. So on June 16th and 17th, we will have our keynotes and two awesome panel discussions. So it's gonna be shorter, so people don't have to be sitting in their chairs or they're standing at their desks um, watching us. It will be a little bit shorter from one to four, but we really can't wait to have this presentation and all the information provided to you. In addition to that, we do have the same keynotes that we had promised for the in-person conference. A few things that we had to do a little differently just to ensure that people were not having to sit at computers for multiple hours on end to make it a little easier for people to access is we broke up our session tracks into weeks. So you can see on the screen here that the first week is gonna be that kickoff with the keynotes and the panel. And we're also hoping to do karaoke or trivia that Saturday that would be family friendly. We know it's something that everybody loves and we just wanted to make sure that we're still doing a lot of those fun activities. If you look here, you can see that we still have that employer support and engagement track. We have the organizational growth track, diversity and employment track, emerging trends in research and public policy and grassroots advocacy, school to work transition, pushing boundaries, and we will be doing things throughout those weeks like ABC Talks in between uh, to kind of provide some special exciting things. Additionally, we will be having uh, weekly newsletters that will highlight the special activities in terms of networking and the sessions that will be done. You can look on our website and see um, the sessions that will be presented as well. Each of the sessions those weeks will be taking place at 1 p.m. Eastern time until 2 p.m. Eastern time. And the second week with the employer supports, we actually have two sessions each day. So one will be at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and the other one will be at 2.15 Eastern Standard Time. So we're excited. We're very happy that our presenters have been willing to make this shift with us and we're hoping to make it exciting and really informational for everyone. In addition to that, a uh, big highlight for me is the fact that if you cannot be with us when we're playing the uh, sessions and going through it live, you can actually listen on your own time. So anybody that is a registered attendee for the conference will have access to all of the sessions and all of the tracks. Uh, in addition, and I'll, you'll see this later, it will be open for our attendees and participants until December 31st, 2020. So no need to try to cram it all in if you can't. If you can, that's great, but we wanted to make it flexible for everyone. Networking opportunities will be taking place throughout those seven weeks. We're hoping to have some regional sessions, some chapter leadership networking opportunities, opportunities, some content specific networking options that would be based on the tracks of that week. And I know I mentioned trivia and karaoke as well. We're also hoping to have a few maybe um, activities that you can sign up for. You can find that in the newsletters that we'll be sending out. Quick additional information. Uh, we are gonna be having APSI talks. It's gonna be a little different. Uh, we will be videotaping those and then we will release them to all the participants throughout those seven weeks. So you can watch them when you have time. There's a lot of fun topics and I do love APSI talks. So we wanted to make sure we were still able to do that. I mentioned before that the uh, content will be available for many months. So you'll have that, which is wonderful. Additionally, there will be 35 plus hours of professional development available to you. I tried to break it down just because I'm used to doing webinars and I know uh, with conferences, I think about this too, that's less than $15 per session. So if you think about it, you're getting a ton of wonderful information um, in 
a time period that you can manage. If you want to do it all at once, great. If not, you don't have to. There will be continuing ed credit opportunities just like there would have been at our in-person conference as well. So more to come on that. But overall, we just wanted to make sure that everybody knew we're excited, our presenters are excited, and we are building an amazing virtual conference for you to enjoy with your family if you want. <laughs> so we hope to see you, more information to come, and thank you again 